Приветики! Ти столетики! Now she say привет! Yeah, привет усим! Because... I say привет like you! Привет! Привет усим! Привет! Привет! So, it's been a long time we didn't upload videos. We, sorry for that. And yeah. uh, we just realized that our last video was uh, a few months ago. Few months ago, yeah, about our marriage and before that about Paris. Video in Paris. Yes. It's a good quality video. Hope you like it. This is also one of the reason why we didn't actually we make a lot of video, but I didn't make it upload because I feel like uh, I need high quality video. I don't want and, shitty videos. And you are Virgo and you want everything perfect. So, so. that's why you don't have videos. Yeah. Sorry. But we from time to time watch our video and we enjoy. <laughs> what did we you? do <laughs> last few months? After Paris, we were being very busy working in two different cities. I was working in Zhuhai, and I was the other project, in Tanya in Macau. And we've been kind of like separate at least few days a week, back and forth. Then until New Year's Eve, yeah, we now celebrate together like the last three years. Mm -hmm. And after we went to Phuket oh, for yeah. Ukrainian okay. uh, Christmas, we 7th of January. We had a short vacation, we went to Phuket, Thailand. Then we have some videos. We will show you. Yes. Then it was my first time in Phuket. Not first time in Thailand, but first time in Phuket. Yes. And after you know, it's Chinese New Year, and then this everything happened, and <laughs> everything <laughs> stopped. So we go back to Taiwan. Taiwan for two weeks. Then after we come back to Macau, then so first, no, we should describe how it was. No, we will describe this in the video. Not okay, now. and after in Taiwan, decide go to Ukraine. So from Taiwan, we go back to Macau for one day. We went unpack, to Taiwan. Unpack again. We didn't know that uh, what is going on. He made his visa for the first time very quick. Online. Online. E-visa. And this is the first time I stayed there one month. Yeah, yes, really. Yes, first time. Really first time. Before was like three weeks. But and we didn't travel to the other city. We really spent one month in Odessa region. Because when we get there uh, in February, things start to getting uh, more worse, especially in Asia. But back then in Ukraine was still safe. Like nobody get coronavirus yet in February. Anyway, we still stay in the parents' house in the village for two weeks. Then after go back to city. We didn't travel a lot because we don't want to get this risk. And when we leave in Ukraine, because my visa was only 30 days, things getting worse yeah, in Ukraine. Yeah, in six days after we leave Ukraine, they yeah, closed everything the stopped. Border closed, airline closed, nobody go out, nobody get in. Even you are Ukrainian citizen, you cannot come back home. Only until, by evacuation. Until by. now. Also, this time our life facing a big change because like right now we are not sure we will still work in Macau anymore. I have been working here since 2013 and this is her fourth year staying in Macau. First, this is the only place we can work together, work without any big problems and we can save more money here. But now it's the big time to choose. Are we going to live in somewhere else? Either Taiwan or Ukraine or the third place if we are going to leave Macau. So this time we've been thinking a lot about this. Oh, we have many time to think about it yes like everyone else now we have a, a lot of times to think in our plan was we are going to move to ukraine when we kind of ready that means we are ready for uh, enough saving to have some place to stay and also have enough knowledge for what to do in Ukraine, how to create some new business. business. 
and planning like okay when we're going to have a baby or something like that and we thing... was going to finish our marriage in taiwan yes. after we finish working macau yes our But plan now, we finished the one in ukraine we didn't finish the one in taiwan and this is the tricky one because we need to go to moscow He to need to get office. visa to Russia and I have to prepare some document. It will take some time and now we just cannot do this. Why we didn't do this before? Because when we finish countering Macau, then we will do this. Then we will move to Taiwan to stay for a while. Mm -hmm. Maybe we want a permanent resident in Taiwan. Then maybe we need to live, live to live there for six months or something like that. That's why we didn't finish after three years but now it's kind of difficult to moving around so this things impossible right now <laughs> kind of need to unhold that's stop think about that <laughs> we start so positive and after we have this no problem, this yeah this, this is a lot of problems so we have a lot of problems sorry for that <laughs> so f if we don't think about that then easy way is maybe we are going to move to ukraine soon very if, soon like no. <laughs> next no month. maybe if we are not going to continue okay I, okay i always keep negative i have this thing you know <laughs> i don't want you to keep too much negative otherwise it will happen because so. last few days i cry a lot and uh, if i'm going to move to ukraine right now i really need to learn ukrainian Let me explain them why Ukrainian, because they still have this question. Because in the future, if he want to get a permanent resident, yeah, permanent resident, he need to know Ukrainian, not Russian. If he will speak to them in Russian, they they, they don't care. They will have some test. Yes, and, and he need to know Ukrainian. So. Yeah, for those who want to travel to Ukraine and they don't know what language they should learn. Yeah, it's okay. You can learn Russian as you want. Because If you want to live in Ukraine, you need to know Ukraine. Because Ukrainian is the official language of Ukraine, not Russian. So yes. That is why I don't spend all my time studying Russian and now we, I need to learn Ukrainian. But this is why. So there's a new project maybe you will get interesting it's that 90 days with ukrainian i start two days ago so this is the third day the last four years i'm kind of like avoiding learning ukrainian because russian is big headache already and plus ukrainian i will get confused very easy so the last four years i didn't start start ukrainian much i only know like three words mm -hmm. Please be me, dog. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, the book. This is I love you. So this is only words I know Ukrainian in Ukrainian and Ukrainian and Russian. Actually, they are quite different. When you start to learn, I'm like, oh yeah, it's totally different. But it's really confusing if you learn both language at the same time. Really confusing. Then I will also make project about this 90 days with Ukrainian and I want to say that uh, most of the time he learn really by himself and he just asked me a few questions he watching some video in YouTube he bought some books like you can show them okay this one I buy in bookstore in Taiwan but this is very funny because their cover it looks like um, Indian Bali or something some indonesia stuff i don't know how they can make this mistake <laughs> <But> anyway <laughs> this is the only ukrainian language book that i can find in taiwan which is uh, in english so i need to use english to learn ukrainian you can tell them the author so maybe no need buy, buy <laughs> this is really rare to find but there is a lot of online app and YouTube channel teach you how to learn Ukrainian so you don't have to have this book I but like books so just for me, with the book, uh, book it's, yeah in, it's but you can do it totally without 
books. I'm also trying to teach Danya Chinese Mandarin. I introduce her two system, which first is Zhuying Taiwanese system, and the other Pinyin, which is the other place use how to spell, pronounce uh, Chinese. I would suggest that if she can learn both, like better, she can use both. Like our Taiwanese use Zhuying to input, so you can write some message. And the other place, everyone else use pinyin more, and all the foreigner learn. They start with the pinyin because it's more like English. But however, it's too much for Danya, so she just want to learn zuying. Then after she's kind of stuck <laughs> <laughs> right now. Mm -hmm. Because we don't practice, I learn, and one two days I remember, but uh, after we. I don't use this word. I'm like a fish dory from Nemo. Yeah, this is how Second, we learn. I don't remember. First, we learn how to pronounce chewing or pinging. Then, start from the group of words, vocabularies like colors, like clothes, like t-shirts, and we have like three, four groups right now: time, state, and some. Um, yeah, but not so much chance to practice. I don't have chance to practice. In Macau, everyone speak Cantonese. Can you imagine one day you will speak to me Ukrainian and I reply you Chinese? Let's dream about it, and maybe in Usually, ten okay. years, maybe it will happen. <laughs> I think I think this is like kind of impossible dream for all this international couples for example a and b from different country usually they will always speak a this language or b this language and like us we speak c which and, is english and c is uh, not native language for both of us this is also possible but it's almost impossible that we speak c english and at the same time i can speak ukrainian and she can speak chinese it would be only maybe our next generation. Okay, so this is our update for the last four months. And we didn't say Five, that I had fifth, birthday. Six, six months, huh? I had the birthday, and you make a good surprise for me. It's interesting. Yes, we also had that video. We went to celebrate a little because everything is closed in April, Tanya's birthday. Because. I thought we will stay at home and do nothing and maximum you will buy me a cake but he make it so surprising. I tried to find a flower shop as before but they all closed because the border is closed they don't have flowers from too high anymore so it will be more difficult even to buy flowers now but he did it yeah really beautiful big bucket of so we have a lot of video to show yes. you. Yes. Just need to wait. Be like, patient. It's not <laughs> time, but I just want. I prefer to introduce these videos like a story. One by one. One by were... one and good quality. Yeah. I don't want to just show you some shitty videos. So this video is especially for our YouTube friends. We did some uh, update in our Facebook more often i post every day about this 90 days of ukrainian but for video because you know more editing time more time for subtitle hey, and i don't help him with this so, stuff, so slower so if you are more interesting what is going to happen now then you can follow our facebook and for youtube i hope i provide higher quality videos English speaking with Chinese subtitle and they can follow our Instagram as well I didn't post shit and Tanya posts a lot every day something in my stories beautiful photos but without stories Chinese, yeah. yeah but you can follow our life this is a start to tell you what happened for the last half year we have Thailand video we have Taiwan video we've been to some old house 
then this uh, east of Taiwan. Then after we go to Ukraine, we did the city tour of Odessa. A lot of stories. We stay in very beautiful Airbnb in Ukraine, Odessa. Oh, we even check apartment in Odessa. Few apartment is still under construction. Then we check where is it, how much the price, and birthday video. So. Thank you for watching this video. How to say this in Chinese? 谢谢大家收看这个影片。谢谢大家看这个影片。Yes. 谢谢这个看，呃，谢谢这个大家。谢谢大家看这个影片。嗯哼。If you use Russian, you should be. Uh, Wait a minute. Hey, спасибо всем. Посмотри это видео. Спасибо всем. Спасибо всем, что 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 смотрели. Смотрели это видео. Спасибо всем. Что смотрели? Oh, by the way, <laughs> now I can pronounce this three, three. Yes, he did it at three, night. Three, three. I don't know. Oh, Ed, so sorry. I cannot too much. Dr. When you three, lay, three, lay down, three, you yes. Three, three, three. See, three. Three, three. So after four years, I can pronounce. So in the future, you also can. Three. Yeah. Three. Need to practice. Three. Thank you. Пока. А меня. We forgot to to tell you something. Something Danya forgot to tell you. I'll I'll bring you some bags, but. Okay, we have some candies. Bring back from Ukraine. Mm -hmm. Very beautiful box. And and so tasty that I ate some. No, this is not the important thing. We. <laughs> It's true. We will have maybe three box. We can give it to you if you are in Macau for now. <laughs> But if you are in Taiwan, maybe next time. But you can see how beautiful this box. It's huge. Beautiful, great Ukrainian candy box. <laughs>